Eternal Resonance, the Orm Symbol and Chant. Integration. Hi everyone. Today we're diving into the fascinating world of Orm, a sound that's said to have 1001 meanings. But we want to hear from you. What does Orm mean to you? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe, share, comment and follow us. The term Orm, often written as OM, is a sacred sound and a spiritual symbol in Indian religions, particularly in Hinduism, Buddhism, and Jainism. It is often described as the sound of the universe and is considered the ultimate reality, encompassing the entirety of existence. Here are some key aspects of Orm. Symbolism. The symbol Orm is a combination of three sounds, AUM, and is often visualized with a crescent and a dot at the top. Each component has its own significance. A represents the waking state. U represents the dream state. M represents the state of deep sleep. The silence that follows the chant represents the state of Turiya, or pure consciousness. Chanting and meditation. Chanting Orm is believed to have a calming effect on the mind and body. It is often used at the beginning and end of meditation sessions, prayers, and yoga practices. Philosophical significance. In various Upanishads, Orm is described as the essence of the ultimate reality or Brahman. It is considered the primordial sound from which the universe was created. Cultural and religious practices, Orm is used in various rituals and practices. It is common to find the symbol at temples, in scriptures, and in places of worship. It is also a popular mantra in many spiritual traditions. Cultural and ritualistic use of Orm. 1. In temples and places of worship. Symbolic presence. The symbol of Orm is prominently displayed in Hindu temples and places of worship. It is often found at the entrance of temples, on deities' altars, and in various parts of the temple architecture. Ritual recitation. Chanting Orm is a common practice during pujas, worship ceremonies, and rituals. It is used to invoke the presence of deities and sanctify the space. 2. Daily Practices Morning Prayers Many Hindus begin their day with a prayer that includes the chanting of Aum. This is believed to align the individual with the cosmic energy. Yoga and Meditation Aum is an integral part of yoga practice. It is often chanted at the beginning and end of a yoga session to center the mind and connect with the spiritual essence of the practice. 3. Festivals and Ceremonies Hindu festivals, during major festivals like Diwali, Navratri, and Holai, Orm is chanted as part of the ritualistic hymns and prayers. Life ceremonies, Orm is used in important life ceremonies such as weddings, naming ceremonies, namkaran, and funerals. It is believed to provide blessings and ensure the spiritual well-being of individuals. 4. Artistic representation. Sculptures and paintings, the Orm symbol is a popular motif in Indian art. It is often depicted in sculptures, paintings, and decorative arts. Jewelry and clothing. Orm is also used in jewelry designs and printed on clothing. It is worn as a symbol of spirituality and protection. 5. Educational and cultural institutions. Schools and ashrams. Many educational institutions and ashrams in India incorporate Orm into their daily routines. Students and practitioners chant Orm during morning assemblies and spiritual gatherings. Cultural programs, Orm is often featured in cultural programs, dance performances, and music recitals that explore themes of spirituality and Indian heritage. 6. Global influence. New Age movements. In the West, Orm has been embraced by various New Age and spiritual movements. It is often used in meditation, mindfulness practices, and alternative healing. Popular culture. The symbol of Orm has found its way into popular culture, appearing in tattoos, fashion, and even corporate logos, symbolizing peace, unity, and spiritual awakening. Specific rituals involving Orm. 1. Homa, fire ritual. Invocation. During the Homa, Orm is chanted to invoke the deities and purify the surroundings. The chant accompanies offerings made into the sacred fire. Meditative chanting. Participants often chant Orm in unison, creating a collective meditative state that enhances the spiritual efficacy of the ritual. 2. Japa, repetitive prayer. Mala beads. Devotees use mala beads to chant Orm repetitively, a practice known as Japa. 
This is done to focus the mind and achieve a deep meditative state. Daily Routine Japa with Orm is incorporated into daily routines to maintain spiritual discipline and mindfulness. 3. Bhajans and Curtains, Devotional Songs. Musical Chanting, Orm is often chanted at the beginning and end of Bhajans and Curtains. These devotional songs are a key part of community worship and spiritual gatherings. Enhancing Devotion, the inclusion of Orm in these songs is believed to enhance the devotional atmosphere and connect the participants with divine energy. Orm is not just a symbol or a sound, it is a profound element woven into the fabric of cultural, ritualistic, and daily life in Indian society. Its usage spans across various aspects of life, reflecting its deep spiritual significance and universal appeal. Whether through daily prayers, artistic expressions, or global spiritual practices, Orm continues to resonate as a timeless symbol of peace, unity, and the ultimate reality.